Okay. okay. <laughs> I'm going to try and put as much energy into this as possible and please mind me in terms of like if the energy is not as strong because guys as I said before I am currently fasting. Let's get to it. What up YouTube? My name is Riz Il and today I'd like to welcome you back to my channel. We're going to be doing another first time reaction and this one is going to be uh, an Asian girl group. An Asian, yeah an Asian girl group. I mean you can sort of see it sort of in the eyes uh, <laughs> we're gonna be doing another asian girl group and uh this the, this one is um their name is Dreamcatcher, and uh they're gonna be doing a song called endless nights it's gonna be a first time reaction i'm really glad that uh, honestly with the way this channel has been going you guys have helped me break the monotony of uh the same old same old you know uh with all your all your suggestions basically um uh, everything that you put in into your suggestions to make sure i find my way and i see this new exciting stuff that you guys are excited for and i'm truly grateful uh so we're gonna be doing dream catcher endless night and this one was suggested by um to smi hey bro wh whoever you are in terms of that at um basically guy or, or girl um forgive me for not memorizing that shit but uh, I, and as, as, again as an excuse I am currently fasting and if I couldn't memorize it like it right there, right then, I'm not putting energy into even touching that laptop. And <laughs> finding you again, bro, just know that I'm truly grateful for your suggestion. And uh, I can't wait to see it, man. The girl, the Asian girl groups haven't exactly been a letdown. They've been very energetic, very professional. And uh, I'm, 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 yeah, I'm excited to see this, whether they're Japanese, Korean. I'm waiting for a Chinese um, Asian group, but... Uh, Fuck it, man. What's the difference? Uh, <laughs> what's the fucking difference? Let's get to it, guys. Let's get to it.
I'm going to make this quick because I pretty much, I don't need to go down uh, too deep in terms of a train of thought. I basically know everything that I've surmised from uh, my impressions of this and uh, the current state of music in general. But you know me, I'm probably going to ramble, right? Uh, <laughs> in terms of this, one, the song is not bad. It's actually a, a nice song. I can't say very nice. I was about to say very nice, but I can't say an a very nice song you know it's actually a nice song it's actually um sort of catchy etc etc uh, i'll tell you what i've noticed about this and uh something that i've sort of mentioned in like uh, a previous uh what you call um reaction that was even in relation to another asian girl group and this isn't just in relation to asian girl groups this is just the music business in general in terms of the music business and the record labels and the a and rs and everything that find these type of artists not enough of them just let them be artists and let them come up with something new there's always an algorithm that they follow in order to find success you know and uh to sidetrack to that that's sort of why i like uh, some of the suggestions you guys have given to this channel in terms of like really original and indie artists really like thought-provoking artists etc etc because they have basically gone back to the formats of being very original in the way they do things and very professional rather than following a quick uh, fo yeah following a quick algorithm to success this honestly screams a quick algorithm to success because even though as always like with all these especially asian girl groups from like how i've mentioned they keep a, a high level of professionalism a high level of execution it's not over sensualized over sexualized you know they don't over sexualize their women they keep them um beautiful striking but also like they keep them covered they keep them humble etc etc even though there's all those elements and even you can see they're trained in terms of uh, artistry itself you know they're not oh my god incredible but you can see they're very well trained in terms of execution you I don't know about you, me as someone who makes music, etc. I said someone is very involved in the music business, struggling like hell to make a way for my own self. I haven't been discovered. I haven't been like given my own shake, whatever. Um, I can clearly tell from an artist ear, from a writer's like, you know, mind, from a producer's perspective, like. This has followed a quick algorithm to success. This whole construction of the song, even the short little rap verse that they involved over there, that girl didn't need to rap. That girl didn't need to rap, but they added it there because they're following a quick, algor a quick algorithm in order to find some sort of traction and some sort of climb in what they're trying to do. And that's the problem with these guys. I don't know whether they, these labels, they just want money fast, or maybe they just don't know what the hell they're doing, but, or maybe the, the a and specifically, maybe they just don't know what they're doing, but every time, like, these artists are presented, a lot of them in, in music, in the music business world over, and a lot of them fail, honestly, that's why these labels lose money, honestly, and they, they resort to this, this uh, basically, uh, cheat codes in order to maybe find someone who can gain them, like, money fast these a and r's and like the way they manage these artists always seem to come up with the same old shit and the same old way of doing things in term instead of something original and the only time they seem to find something original is either they get lucky and that's very rare or someone on tiktok or whatever goes viral and they are such a find that they immediately rush to them to sign them they never just find these people like og artists original indie like really creative artists and really people who are really doing something different they have to damn near go viral for these a and r's to find them for these labels and powers that be to find them other than that you can clearly see these people like they don't know what they're doing with artists bro you can create you can you can clearly see unless someone goes viral they pretty much taking like a bunch of girls who are very trained etc yeah mostly girls honestly nowadays girls who are very trained who are very poised etc who they can control and then they put him in front of the screen and say, do this, do that. And then they try to make generate a quick hit. And that is why, honestly, in today's reaction, 
it was a nice song but i wasn't like blown away to the point where i'm like jamming i, I just honestly it's, uh, like i i just like like just sitting there and just like reviewing it but honestly i didn't care i didn't care for this not that it was a bad suggestion or whatever but i i honestly didn't care and that's because it's it's the same old same old there's nothing new under the sun in terms of this song and um hopefully if someone suggests something different from dreamcatcher um maybe they'll do better not even maybe they'll do better there's definitely a chance they'll do better i mean you clearly see that these girls are professionals they have the ability to do better but uh nah today in terms of even this song it made me like it's already established in my mind where we at right now in the music business and it is what it is guys it is what it is even like me artists that i've worked with my friends you know etc any one of us can get can get signed like tomorrow and we won't like first thing they'll do is they won't even ask us for like our originality and our original music they'll just place us in front of something and make us do some bullshit algorithm shit uh like this honestly speaking no offense um so that's been my uh, opinion uh and my review of this like comment subscribe hit the post notifications and um uh, if you didn't like uh what i've had to say um uh, shit dude it is what it is we'll see whether stuff like this works out in terms of what these labels do with these artists we'll see you can tell them all it's way too late way too late way too late <laughs> to stay in this bit whole lot of students be trying it even the odds you should just play with your wrist one hit of quitters from niggas who wait to legit but i'm still trying to feed it the ride i had a slip up when shoddy was